now to send into madness. Oh my god. you imagine just going down and you seeing all those eggs? Nope! I wouldn't even go all the way down. I'd just be like, no, nah, you can reel me back up. We're good. Like, seriously, you're going on a ship that you don't know what's going on, and... You see all these eggs? Why would you go and explore? Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go. What is going on, everybody? It's Merc, and welcome back to part 6 of my Alien Isolation gameplay. So all of this has been recorded on my Twitch live stream. I'll leave a link right above me again so you can go and check out where to be at for the next time that I am streaming this game or any other game that is coming your way. But until then, let's go back on Sebastopol and see what exactly Amanda Ripley can do to escape. Let's go. Get to Colonial Marshall Bureau. Right, let me, let me save first. I can't believe I dead it earlier. Like, what was that about? Ripley, we're in the Marshall Bureau. Just turn right at the top of the stairs. You can't miss it. Yeah. Just get up here. Wait out. They say that, but then watch an alien just pop up. Oh my God! How nice. Calm down. Calm down. We're safe now. Wakes has a plan. A plan? Really? All right, cool. Was that you? Plans haven't done Did as you get much the transit so running? Nice work. Thank you. Maybe we'll be safe here. Maybe. For now, anyway. Okay. Everybody's cozy here, but... This doesn't stop the Xenomorph running around, Past doing its thing. Stable. Should be walking soon enough. Samuels is with her now. Okay, so she's... Okay. ...getting better. You managed to get transit up and running, so I guess... So I guess I can save. Okay. <clears throat> Look, I'm busy. I've got Marlo in the cells, the lowlife who showed up with your flight recorder. Where's Marlo's ship? The Anisadora. He put it in a parking orbit around the gas giant. Right. Son of a bitch won't okay. the command codes to let us bring it in on auto. Maybe you can get more out of the unhelpful bastard. Go talk to him. Talk to Marlo. Let's see where Marlo is. I've got a revolver, so that should make him talk. Marlo? Who wants to know? My name's Ripley. I'm with the company. Here for your empty box. Who Harry. wants to know? Oh, you know. Okay. Dirty yeah. Harry. <laughs> I'm here for personal reasons. My mother was on the Nostromo when it was missing 15 years ago. You serious? Shit. Well. Shit. Yeah. We never found her ship, Ripley. Just the recorder. But you sure as hell found something else. What happened out there? I need a way out of here, Ripley. Maybe we can make a deal. Cause of Just cause. Just start talking. I want to know everything. Alright, here we go. It's movie time, folks. Com check. You get me, Lewis? A little fuzzy, Marlo, but you're coming. I remember this part, I think. Okay, enough already. Focus on what we're here for. I don't want any mistakes. Alright, there we go. We're gonna go on... You know what? I'm not gonna say it, because if anybody hasn't seen this gameplay, then I'm not... I'm not gonna let y'all know what's gonna happen. Just enjoy the ride. There you are. Foster, Meeks, keep your eyes open. Follow the signal. Oh, I could just follow these guys and girls. Hmm. Okay. Have you managed to decode the signal yet? Negative. We can't tell what it is. That's good. If it's a mystery, then it's unknown. If it's unknown, then it could be valuable. This could be our biggest haul, Marlo. 
Let's salvage everything. <laughs> Dude, do you pushing out the way? I wonder if um, Ridley Scott and Dan O'Bannon have played this game. I wonder what they think of it. There's another story was written by Dan Ablett, who's kind of, who, not kind of, who is a legend in, um, I'll have a look around. See in if the I can Warhammer universe, so. Wait here. Find a route around the blockage. Well, maybe I can just not go this way. You know, I was watching, um, Oat Studio, um, by, oh, I keep forgetting his name. The guy who did District 9 and um, Neil Blomkamp, that's it. And I'm like, yeah, man, uh, he, it was a close one, though. after watching this, the, the, the series, I really wish that the sequel to Aliens was have been made by him. That was made by him. I, I really wish it was. But 20th Century Fox said that, no, we're not going to make it because Ridley Scott doesn't want it because he wants to make Alien Covenant. Then people had a lot of mixed feelings about Covenant, and um, well, everybody's waiting for the third movie, but no one knows whether the third movie's going to come out yet. They're still salty. We never got Alien Five. Me and you both, brother. Me and Stay you both. I think I found something. Especially if you watch Out Studios uh, shots on Netflix, you'll understand what I'm talking about. I'm going the wrong way. See, I'm blabbing too much. I'm going the wrong way. I'm glad it tells me where I need to go. Well, that'll be stuck. Move back. Yeah, I'm moving back. Am I good? Cool. I did not want to be near there. <laughs> Just going. Heist, over here. Give me a leg up. Okie dokie. Can I... Are you gonna help me traverse? No, I'm not. Okay. This place is kind of a way away, isn't it? Here we go. Check it out. It's the Maker's ship. Cool, huh? It's also cool when you see that in the uh, Fire Team Elite. Fire Team Elite. It's, um, yeah, it's cool. Find the source of the signal. It's inside the ship. I remember seeing, like, obviously I wasn't alive in 1979, but when I saw the movie Alien, and you see the the engineer ship, and they go into it, and you see the the space jockey. I thought, man, that's so cool. Like, I wonder what the story is behind it. And then the maiden, I was like, it wasn't really how I envisioned it, but I'm glad that they looked into it. You know? Enter the derelict. Man. I wonder how long it took the engineers to, to make that. Uh, yeah, the shots were great. The first story with the alien reptiles is a story you'd love to see more of. Yeah, they're great. I like the one, you know, where the woman is escaping that creature that's just made full of, you know, human limbs. When I was seeing that episode, I thought, this is literally how... Like, I was getting these alien vibes from it. Like, this is how it, the movie could be. But... Even Sigourney Weaver, she was totally on it. She's like, Bloom Clamp, I love Bloom Camp, sorry. I love how this sounds. I definitely want to be a part of it. James Cameron was like, yeah, I definitely want to be a part of it as well. I think Michael Bean was like, yo, you're going to bring Hicks back in? You're going to wipe away Alien 3? Yo, I definitely want to be on it. So it was going to be like, 
the ultimate dream. The ultimate sequel. The... Oh well. Careful with what you touch. I don't want See, that's to just so it. cool. It's amazing. How old must this be? What is it? A cockpit? That is just so cool. <laughs> I think we found our payload. Hey, quiet. Wow. How much would that go for, do you think? Hey, sorry, pal. Can it. We're wasting time. Have a look around. Hey, no says movie night in Discord, maybe? It's a life form. It was it's an option. Form. I just now need to try and get it work. Property. Salvage rights. We need to stake our claim before anyone else does. And is not prepared. It's just so cool how it's. Then we'll take what we can and come back. Have a look around, see what else is here. Marlo, we found something. Tracks. Tracks? It looks like something was dragged. But that's not all. Where are they? Oh, there they are. You're not gonna like this. What is it? The tracks lead here. The same name that's on the flight recorder. No strong one. I can see that. Shit. Right, okay. Well, if they're still alive, there goes our salvage. Let's find out. I'll find the beacon and shut it off. Don't want anybody else finding this place. Foster, Heist, check out the cavern below. Locate the distress beacon. It's down here. That's why. I want to jump down here. Let's go. <laughs> no, I'll keep looking around. Right. Meeks, I found the beacon. Yeah, that's pretty much the beacon. <laughs> All right, how do you disable this thing? <coughs> okay, cool. I did it. Hopefully I just don't implode or something. It just shoots its energy into me and then yeah. Marlo, you have got to see this. It's amazing. On my way. It's like, it's an egg. It's like, no, nah, no, nah, I don't want to see the egg. <laughs> Neither do you. Run. Or oh, space hop. <laughs> this place just keeps on giving. Here, strap yourself in. Yeah, butter. It's all lightweight. <laughs> Yeah, that's the last time you're doing a thumbs up, man. Now to send into madness. Labyrinth. Yes, it was that one. Thank you for letting me know. That was a good story, by the way. Oh my god. Can you imagine just going down and you seeing all those eggs? I wouldn't even go all the way down. I'd just be like, no, nah, you can reel me back up. We're good. It's like, seriously, you're going on a ship that you don't know what's going on, and you see all these eggs? Why would you go and explore? Like, just no. <laughs> just absolutely no. But as they do. And that's what happens. Everything. Where's your ship? If we can break the comms lockdown, what are the codes to bring it in on auto? If you want more, then you need to get me out of here. Not happening, Marlo. Is that right? Well, you know where I am. Great. Okay, this way. Got something here you'll need. Yoink. Oh, he's not talking about the scrap. <laughs> oh, that's what I need. Get out my way. Let me get the flamethrower. It's an animal. Animals are afraid of fire. I hope you're right. Oh, yeah. All maxed out, but yo, let me um, flamethrower 500, right? Man, I'm I'm gonna do work now. I am going to do work. What's here? Let me just check what's on this terminal, and then we should be good. 
Uh, first trap gone. Wait, we're at trap down. The creature set off explosives. We set in the habitation tower, and I'm hearing reports of damage to the space flight terminal docks. I don't think we can put a dent in it. There's activity in San Cristobal, so maybe it's gone back. Find a way over to the SkyMed. SkyMed? Towers Transit. Hope to God the centers and medical reception are still online. <laughs> Burn that. <laughs> you can. Hold on. Move on my way. I'm just thinking to myself, I did save, didn't I? Right, 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 okay, okay. So I need to get past these guys. I may use a flare again, you know. I'm gonna use a flare again. That dude is not budging at all over there. The creature's here. You what? You heard the lady. Let's go. Bruh. They're good guys. Come on, man! They're good guys. I wasted a flare for nothing. Uh dude. Your head. He's a good guy, right? Alright, he's, he's cool. I just don't know who to trust in this game anymore. It actually tell me whether I'm going the right way or not. So, a bit lost. A bit stumped. But this is glowing green, so I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna press it. And I think... That, yeah. <laughs> Was that my other robot friend? I don't know. I had another one. I don't know whether to run because it may just pop down. He's, he's my dude. He's my dude. He's alright. Oh, this is, this is a problem right here. There it is. But let me just grab this first. Okie doke. I've done that. Brilliant. Why don't I pretend that I am a Sikhs and android? Maybe the alien will leave me alone. How about that? I could just walk around and talk like a like a robot. <laughs> That's right, Opera. That's right. <coughs> Your joke is so good, I'm choking. Override door mechanism. Let's go. Right, so, um, do 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 do. I'm going straight ahead, right? Wait, can you patch me through to Ripley? Although he's telling me to wait. Ripley, there's an override command that allows you to initiate the emergency lockdown. It's on the terminal behind the reception desk. I'm already ahead of you. Activate Ricardo's override command. What's the number? Seven seven eight nine. Hughes, it's Ransom. I just got your query. Yes, I have been in our transmission relay archive and I've done some decrypting. I've just run this to access the security folder. That's all done. Seven seven eight nine. I've done it. Lock down the server farm. Right. Behind, right? Okay, cool. He's just standing there, man. Like, yo, he's just standing there. How am I? How am I? What a question to ask me at this time. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, you have not had the pleasure. Yo, let me go into the server farm. Let me collect some scrap. Here we are, but yo, let me just pick up that first. Yo, I can't turn that off. Alright, fine. Alright, brilliant, taking that off. Anything in here? <clears throat> right, okay. Let me see if I can just try and do something here. 
Um, Darks has air purification. All right now, I should be able to go through that, right? Cool. Then go back to the dog. And yeah. Hano says, I believe I have not had the pleasure of oh, choking you. <laughs> no, but your buddies did. Alright, um, hey, I'm back here. Awesome. Let's go, let's go. Unidentified species. Oh, man. Well, I've got the magic stick. It's too quiet here. Oh, no. I know, I know, I've got the... Wait a minute. I know I've got the flamethrower, but I still do not feel easy being here. You know what I mean? What's that? Take everything. Alright. Yo, what's up? What's up? Aha, see ya. Fool. I'm saying that, but man, it may drop down and just take me out. Oh no. Turn around, turn around, turn around. Man, yo, that was taking forever. Can I call? All right, all right, all right. Um, right, okay, okay, I could do this. You know, if you have anxiety, right? If you're a very anxious person. Probably not the best thing to get this game and play this game, <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> right, now I need to... Is my exit open, Ricardo? Wait a minute. Ricardo, is my exit clean? Jesus, Dude, you, you are on my team, right? Escape the server. Oh, yo. I thought that was it. Oh, it is it. I think he's dead. That I gotta press more than once. <laughs> and then I'll get the fuel, all right? <clears throat> right, okay. Let's do this. So now I need to find a place where I can hide, all right? So I definitely can't go through there. Um, can I access you? Okay. I can do. Um... Okay, awesome. Escape the server hub. Oh, wow. Nani? No. Ricardo, you got new 
this for me. I need more time. I don't have more time. Snap. Yo, can you get closer than that? Going up, my going down. You let it out. We had it locked down, and you let it out. Ripley, it's still on your tail. I know it's still on my tail. Where should I go? <coughs> Take the elevator to Gemini Labs. If it follows, we can still trap it there. Ripley, Ricardo, we can't let it escape again, no matter what. Don't make me do this. What do you mean, don't let me shoot it? Um, I'm going the wrong way. If it shoots. Right, it shot me there, so I think the alien should be coming now. It's telling me to go back. Oh, man. I need to go through Seeks and Communications, right? Kinda of good, <laughs> but anyway, I just need to go now. I think I was at the right one the whole time, you know. I wasn't. No, I wasn't. Oh man, that was crazy. So, yo, there it is. Part six done of my Alien Isolation Twitch livestream gameplay. If you did enjoy it, and if you do want to see more and see how unfair this game can be make sure to like share comment subscribe and also hit the notification bell so you know the next time the video does drop you're the first person then but until then i'll catch you all very soon have a great rest of the day night wherever that you are in the world and stay safe peace don't forget to subscribe